What's up, everybody? It is Crypto Muscle, the internationally known Crypto Muscle, coming to you with another YouTube video. And in this video, it is more Moonbird bullshit. I mean, uh, news. Sorry, I meant, um, let's see if there are actual factual news going on with Moonberg. Even though I like to spew the BS that they put out there, the lies, the, the things that they say they're doing, the, the claims, and all that stuff that they say. I like to present the factual side of things. So, with Moonberg, we all know that they've stopped paying for months on end now and all with the exception of two days of barely any sort of daily profit and so even i had a guy today commented on one of my videos recently uh that i did and he was asking me how do i get my moon coins out and it's like man where's this guy been this guy doesn't know he hasn't been paying attention to his own platform you know he's asking me how to get his money out and it's like I just tell them the bad news that you can't get your money out. You're stuck. You know, because they, they tell you, because he was saying, you know, he, he's had his money, his coins in the instant exchange for like the last two months or the order book exchange. You know, I'm just like, wow, you know, this guy really hasn't been paying attention at all because they've taken away that option a long time ago. And so besides taking away that, order book exchange option, the instant exchange option, the zero payouts, zero profits, zero moon phones because they, because the moon phones exit scam Moonberg. Well, let's just say they didn't even exit scam. Let's just say they never existed. That's the fact, right? That moon phones never existed. You know, even if you can look at the pictures that they sent to G, uh, E and J Gold, because if you go back to some of his prior videos, uh, there's a video he posted showing a picture of. Oh shoot! You can even go look through the old Telegram messages as well, and you could probably see the old picture that they said. Oh, here's proof that we have a moon phone being sent out to E and J Gold, and that was posted. And you look at the picture. There's really not a picture of a telephone. It was just a package, of a plastic package, and that was all you could see. There's no evidence of a moon phone at all, and that was it. And it's like, okay, and so as a couple months passed, you know, it doesn't take a couple months to send a moon phone over to California, because that's where Ian Jago lives. And, uh, yeah, do doesn't get it. And then he gets message saying, oh, we got you. We're going to send you your phone real soon, back in January. And, uh, again, it doesn't take like three and a half months Three months, I'm sorry, not three and a half months, three months to send a phone over to California, so, bullshit lies, you know, but, uh, yeah, so, Moonberg, uh, I gotta go back to Moonberg, so, they try to talk about going to this, uh, Hackberg exchange, okay, so they have a legitimate excuse, because they're not able to get the mining rigs, the equipment they needed to get to fill the empty warehouse, because they, they went, and show proof of the warehouse. Right? They toured the warehouse. And, hey, look, guys, this is the warehouse. And they showed all these mining rigs, right? Thinking that it could be for Moomba. No, it's just some mining rigs for some other company. But the warehouse is real, and this is where it's going to be. Or it could just be staged, though, and not even be for Moomba. They just wanted to show something for the people, you know? So, wherever that is, Hackbird's been put on hold because they can't get rigs over from China because of closed borders, coronavirus. So that's legit. I could see that. It's, it's, you know, I understand that. But to say that, oh, you know, we're not, we haven't been, you know, you guys, you know, we haven't been able to send profit, you know, because of coronavirus and trying to hide behind that. Now that's a bullshiz lie. So let's just see what's going on in Telegram. I always like to show the facts in Telegram. You know, this is where it all comes from. I don't pull things out of my ass. You know, this is just, this is all I present to you. And you can see the words itself that they say. So, you know, this guy's asking, you know, nothing has changed for half a year. You're just wondering where's all our money that went into the license, referring to the moon bots, right? And they say, 
this guy here, Moon Mac, Crypto Mac, Crypto Bang, oh, you know, he has all these aliases. Uh, please, boy, look around and understand the situation in the world. No one, even three months ago, expected this situation to arise. Within a few weeks, big world economies collapse overnight. Hang tight. Be okay. This would be a great time to plant your seeds for growth in the future. Referring to the, the new stuff that they're trying to put out there, these new um, moon trader bots that they're trying to sell to people now. Um, and it's like, well, what are you going to do with the people that have moon coins, you know? And so, so you know, all of a sudden, oh, you know, nobody saw this thing coming. And, and uh, yeah, just hang in there, you know. We're all suffering right now. You know, just trying to hide behind the coronavirus label. But they've gone well long months before this. Blame it on a little drop from a $1,000 from 7,000 to 6,000 BTC in a week. And after that, even though BTC went up to 10,000 for weeks and, st and stood there for weeks, and even at 9,000 for weeks, they still didn't pay out saying they're still recovering from their sudden drop, you know, which is bullshit again. So, uh, yeah, so uh, let's move on here. It's unfortunate to hear this because we invested in trade, not instant exchange. I hope there will be still a chance to sell our moon coins. Yeah, good luck with that one. Uh, it is a project. You bought a coin token and was promised to leave it. Oh, okay, so... Uh, let's see. It is blocked right now for the audit. I hope it's finished this week so we can start trading again. Referring to the BDT exchange because it's in audit for how, how long has that thing been on? That thing has been promised. If you go back to the early, early days, all you Moonberg historians out there, you go to the early, early days, mid last year when they first was, you know, up and about and everything was good, they said, oh yeah, we're going to have the BDT exchange. Uh, coming in October, that's going to replace the instant exchange, right? And that came and went. They continue on with the instant exchange, and this uh, whole BDT exchange has been an audit ever since. Oh, months and months as well. How long is, you can't even get profit. You can't even get this BDT exchange going. And then, you know, it's like, what is going on here? Look at this. Uh, let's see. So. They just want to get their moon coins to be able to buy this new Binance bot, right? And so they want to do that. The team is preparing for documents for marketing form for the mining right now. And we are waiting for delivery date. So he's just kind of posting, reposting what it was said. And uh, nothing's really come, right? Can you comment on all your words in the last three to four months? I like that. Look at that. He's coming right at it. Look at this. Talking about that with the Binance bot. This is the original Binance bot, not the one that's been set on the sidelines, not the one that they've come up with now with this Moon Traders concept. So what are you going to do with these Binance bots that you have people buy? Uh, the team is preparing documents for the marketing on the mining right now. Well, the mining's been put on hold. We all know that. Until the DEX is live, I hope for next week, I'm waiting, the first support will take place, the mining. All right, so yeah, we all know that's not coming right now. Uh, let's see here. Uh, okay, so he's asking for an explanation. Uh, ArkhamSecure.com has been down for months for unknown reasons. All this worries me. Well, it's been down for months. It's been down for at least a month or two. I mean, it's been, it's been down. And uh, I watched it go down and just kind of haven't come back since. Um, oh, let's see here. I got the Arkham Secure link. Let's see if it's, if they re, let's see if they brought this back up to life. Nope. Arkham Secure is still gone. So, yeah, they've uh, obviously never had the moon phones. That's just proof right there. So... This happened because the owner, let's see, it's not our website, it's not our phone. We paid him for, oh, so here we go. This is what Tobias is saying. This happens because the owner from it is working on the presentation. It's not our website, it's not our phone. We paid him for the development, and he is with his company, the shipping and development person. If you like an answer to the points above, you can tell me how mining can start when the borders are closed. 
and I'm lucky to get an answer, but be lucky the mining does not start until now because right now it would be a big, big minus with marking conditions. Okay, the marking conditions. Uh, okay, so excuses. Oh, yeah, it's not from me. It's the owner of the website. It's not our phone. Then why the heck are you presenting the phone? Why are you trying to sell the phone if you have nothing to do with it? That doesn't make any sense. So, let's see. All right, so look at this. There will be no fix soon that this is from the facts, not possible. With good products, it can be a value again. On the moon, step by step. Moons is the new replacement token of moon coins. Uh, as they converted it to moons now, just recently. Uh, then he just pretty much said, you're uh, shit out of luck, sorry, but you can buy it. Value loss again, blah, 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 all right. So here you go. Here's the uh, mouthpiece here. Moon Mad, just kind of being the, the echo of Tobias. So all the answers, of course, the virus has hit every aspect of our lives. Yes, they're using the virus as an excuse. Yes, it was affected through the huge drops, but the main issue with the instant exchange. And now Mr. Whale with the reputation damage, the other guy, uh, Kristoff, uh, that they're blaming here as well. They, uh, the reputation damaged by Kristoff. Oh, yeah. The moon bots, the new bots are usable. Yeah, it's not really clear if this is the desktop bot or the old Binance bot they're talking about. So they're saying that you know, a bunch of other BS stuff here. Um, another thing that they keep saying is, oh, you could just sell it on uh, Ether Delta, McAfee Dex, Fork Delta. So let me show you what you got here. I checked in on all three of those for you. So here's Ether Delta, right? MOS, the, the new moons coin here. You got zero going on, nothing going on. Nobody's putting nothing on here. Let's go take a look at McAfee Dex. McAfee Dex, MOS. Yeah, I mean, you could switch to whatever currency you want. ETH. I mean, there's nothing going on. Nobody's putting nothing out here. I mean, you could put it a DAI to MOS. There's so much stuff here. There's just nothing, you know. And so... Let's go with the last one here, Fork Delta. You got the same ones that was put here the other day, and it's the same thing. Nothing's going on here. People put orders up, but then you can't do anything. No one's buying it. No one can sell it. So you're pretty much stuck either way. But they're saying, oh, yeah, just put it on the exchange, you know, and you can sell it there. Oh, yeah, okay, sure, I'll put it out there because uh, it's going to, you know, someone's going to buy it. Uh, yeah, bullshit again. So, you know, that's what they're saying, though. So, um, let's keep going here. See, they keep touting about, oh, look at the big percentages here with these, uh, with this new desktop bot they're talking about, right? But then yet, why don't you help the original people out that got you there in the first place, the people with all the moon bots, right? Yeah, we're running this space, all right. Oh, yeah, we're running this space, but you're still leaving all the, the moon people, the moon bot people behind. So, what's up with that? So... I don't know, it's just, I just don't see what you guys are doing. So yeah, so this guy says, uh, this is a bit upsetting, you know, because he's not able to see any profit. I mean, it's been like this for months. Now look at this here. I just want to earn as well, but not look at your profits. So it's pretty funny, you know, how he's posting all these profits, right? Right here. So you're seeing him earn the profits, but nothing that benefits them. So, you know, here you go. Here's Tobias again. Uh, now I tell you my situation. I lost in this project two hundred fifty thousand dollars from my own private pocket because he was a Tobias bot buying back all those moon coins to make it look like it was working and there was demand, but there wasn't any. So, so it was the Tobias bot that bought all this back right here, and so he's not, he has nobody to blame but himself. He bought it back when he probably didn't have to, but that's all on him. And so, and then he also says that he has one full idiot crashed the whole concept blaming Kristoff and one wrong decision with the instant exchange so that's what he's saying that his issues are it says uh, I'll wait to see what happens in the next two to four weeks this guy here and then Tobias says uh, sometimes better if you just wait for another half year or more which is kind of funny because it's never going to come back the way it was so yeah I just thought I just wanted to present all that all this BS that goes on in Moonberg and more so 
We'll see as this thing continues to go and crash and burn. And so, yeah, comment down below. Let me know what you think. I'll see you in the next one.